first thing of the season, you must be delighted. <laughs> just massive, massive relief. I mean, we didn't want to go down with zero points on the board. That would have been massively embarrassing. So we knew exactly what we wanted to do today. We wanted to come in and get some points and to get all three. It's just a real positive note to end the season on. And um, so I remember in a post-match interview this season, almost sounded a bit silly when she keeps saying, well, we've not deserved it, not deserved it, but this has been coming, hasn't it? Yeah, do you know what? I mean, like, we weathered the storm today, uh, defensively. Like, there was periods of time in the game where they were they were on top. They were definitely on top. Um, and weathering those storms gave us a little bit of confidence. And then, obviously, Katrin took her chance when she got it, uh, clinical in front of goal, which is what we've been saying all season. And also, I think we could have had, like, three or four because Mary Earps has had an absolutely stunning game. She pulled off, like, three or four absolute worldy saves there. Um, so it could have been a few more, I think. Um, and talking of defence, as captain and, and leading that, that back line, you must have been unbelievably proud of how they defended today, especially well, Sophie Barker at right back was outstanding. Yeah, Sophie Barker at right back, Rhiannon Roberts, week in, week out, puts a body on the line. And like we said that today, we said we need to come here, we need to defend for our lives, we need to put our body on the line. And we kept concentration, that's been the difficult thing for us. For the full 90 minutes, we haven't kept concentration, but we did it today and I think it's a well-deserved three points. And uh, just back to Mary Earps, you must have been thinking it's going to be one of them days when she's pulling off saves like that. Yeah, do you know what, I thought she had an absolutely uh, amazing game. Um, she's pulled off like three or four really, really good quality saves. Um, so disappointing for us to not get them more, but a uh, really good performance for her. And uh, I mentioned to uh, I mentioned Emma in an interview there about sort of the likes of Sam Tierney in there, who's probably the youngest player on the pitch today, and probably the coolest head in there. And, and she's outstanding. It's, it's something to build on for next season with, uh, with the, yeah, the agent squad. Sammy T, she's like developed this season as well. She's been put in different roles. She's obviously played alongside me at centre half. She's been in, the, um, in central midfield, like that holding role. And she's just developing all the time. She's a really bright future ahead of her and a, a young talent that the Bells will look to develop. Um, she's come on leaps and bounds and she's actually you know, developing her game. She's putting tackles in and she's, she is, like you said, keeping a real cool head. So, yeah, one to watch for her future, I think. And uh, you mentioned in your interview in sort of midweek about doing it for the fans and you, you definitely did it tonight and we had a, another big following here today. You must have been delighted to do it for them Yeah, as well. brilliant. I mean, if you hear them throughout the whole game, loud and proud, singing. They were here, they met the coach when we got here and they're still here now just uh, saying... Um, well done to all the players and that's just uh, absolutely fantastic can't ask any more of them and they've travelled all the way down here the Sunday night cold wet and uh, some of the kids I'm sure have got school tomorrow so they might be falling asleep in class but I'm sure it'd be worth it to have seen us got the three points